soul of my soul. I've been prostituting my losses, been rocking that road. I've been cranking that soldier, boy, boy, I'm hitting that road. It's been hard to find happy, I'm clinging, I'm hitting that note. I've been not locked up dreams, you can't say I didn't try. Pain's guaranteed, do you wanna hurt by my side? Got not going tight, people picking their sides. Wanna think about my life, wanna be alive when I die. I'm pretty sure somebody gotta die for it. Just bought myself a politician, I'ma sneak through the motherfucking side door. Woo, let's get online, let's hurt somebody for the high score. My lord, thanks for the purpose, now I got something I can die for. I'm just grinding like I'm told, I'm just trying to sell my soul. For music, four syllables, it fed me though. Three syllables, it saved me. Two syllables, crazy. One syllable, go. Shameless, everybody's shameless. Monetized oh. life to get Instagram famous. Following blindly, the mind is and brainless. The game is contagious, the pain and the anus. My homeostasis is waking up, wasted. Hey, we'll Selling we'll the money to we'll we'll the struggle. Living in my western bubble. Yeah. Trying to make raps in the rubble. Fuck it. I'm on the cheat coat on. Pull up with the prof with a tinsel on. Do a drive by on a politician, bitch. Die, die. <laughs> I'm famous, mom. I'm just grinding like I'm told. I'm just trying to sell my soul. Honest, I'll be honest. Like oh, I, lo- I love Prof okay. by himself, but like I really like Ren's verse in that the best and for me. Oh yeah, it, it, yeah. I mean, the whole song was good. It was good for sure. But like, it's just, you know, Ren is just his flow is just undeniable. Like it's, I don't even know how to explain it. It's just very melodic. His flow is melodic, and it just, I don't know. He just has a special kind of delivery. It yeah. just it's like very much like Tom. Like Tom stands out in a track right. because of his delivery. It's the same thing with Ren. Yeah, and it's funny because like when we watch like the big push or something, you know, you can tell that Ren is very good at, at sharing the spotlight. And like and then you, yeah. you put like Tom with, you know, like with whoever he's collabing with, he's also very good at sharing the spotlight. And yeah. but like they still shine really bright like you, you just I don't know it's crazy yeah no it's it's yeah it's, yeah sig, sig, it's sigali, that thing. that's that thing. that's exactly what I was thinking I was like this sounds kind of familiar like in a way like I I I got that vibe as well she yeah. said what do you sound, think Carol she said it sounds like Murder Report too yeah carol she's um, quiet that usually means one thing <laughs> i already know i already know i already know what it means when she's quiet she didn't even volunteer to speak yet she was hoping we would forget so we know she's carol she's like, okay opinion. bye guys <laughs> the next one. yeah yeah so that's all for our reaction today guys uh it's uh, okay not to like something. Like it, it, I think it's we okay. get to the point where it's absolutely like absolutely we feel hated obligated. The song. <laughs> I hated it. I absolutely hated it. So I, I, I don't I, look, guys. So um, I am very, very picky about flow and how it sounds. And Croft just didn't do it for me. Um, and he had a lot more to this song than Ren did. Ren's part, I like. Go back and watch the video. You'll see me kind of start bopping a bit. And, you know, I kind of giggle at something that Ren said when he said anus. That was looking hilarious. So, <laughs> but, we have the humor of 12-year-olds. 
but um, I don't think that that Prof is untalented, but this song did not do it for me at all, at all, at all. Like, if I never have to hear it again, I am okay with that. Like, I, I hate to be and very brutally honest, and, but and, that, and, that, no, that's me. Y'all have to understand something. I'd rather, I'd rather real honesty than, like, fake admiration. Carol and you know I, I mean? like, Carol and I talked I'd earlier. I'd rather be real. When we did our reaction to Tom earlier, me and Carol talked earlier, and she said that she was looking forward to to this song. We were we were both looking forward to it. So this was yeah. a disappointment for Carol. <laughs> yeah, well, and it, especially like like when you're pumped. You know what I mean? Like when you're pumped for something yeah. and you want to see it. Because I was like, we have to do it right away. You know, like I I I want to do it. Like you know, I want to do it at the Ooh, beginning of the yeah. live. I'm That's... excited. I want to get to it. But I, I I just and I cannot hide my face. I cannot. Hey guys. You guys will see in this live, you know that I'm very genuine with my reactions because I don't really hide 100%. much. I'm just, I'm just kind of like, mm, okay. Well, like, that's, I just can't. That's why I said, like, you know, Ren, Ren I thought, won it. Like, I just, I think that Ren well, yeah. won that one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But even then, even for Ren, like, I wasn't as, like, as impressed as I would be with most songs. Right. Now, his part was yeah. my favorite. You know, like portion of See, the that's song. The thing too, Sigali, is maybe she yeah. listens to it a few more times. It might, I don't know. Maybe she'll catch something she likes. But. Yeah, I, there's there's um, been songs like that though that I wasn't. There's been songs before that I like didn't really care for. I think Sigali. And the more I listened to him, I was like, okay, like like the more I listened to it, the better it got. But mm -hmm. uh, but then there's just right, some Amy? songs that never really hit. You know, there's just some songs that don't do it. Well, and like I said, it's because I'm really particular about <laughs> with the way people flow. Like it's, it, yeah. I, I'm very particular about it, and it was very almost monotone esque for me. And right. um, there wasn't enough fluctuation. Um, yeah, uh, I, I, it just rhythm rhythmically, it wasn't there. If I could what? say that word, but I'm not gonna try again. Like it just wasn't yeah. there for me, unfortunately. Yeah. Um, I, I just could not vibe to the song at all. I, I it couldn't. definitely I, was I, not. Yeah. It wasn't my definitely favorite. It was not super dynamic. Yeah. It definitely wasn't very dynamic. You know, and that might have been more of a, like, well, in the, it could have maybe, maybe with a different beat or like maybe if the beat were a little bit different or the, maybe if it was mixed a little bit different. Um, But I, you know how I feel about songs that are very like, Especially rap songs that are very monotone, that are just one note. They don't really go anywhere. They don't Amy. make me feel anything like that. I mean, it's a good song for what it is. It's better than some of the shit I've you know heard. I won't uh, lie, I was there for sure. At I, least I was. At least I can understand what they're saying. Right, but I was <laughs> expecting something different. I really was. That wasn't it. Or that wasn't what I was expecting. I didn't hate it, but I wasn't. I was expecting something, yeah. something well else. and honestly like i think it's one of those songs that might be a little bit deeper than they does take a few times to listen to to kind of get it maybe when you get the bars it might might think of it differently because you think pain salesman they're talking about like so this song is about their emotional like well it's like they're like ren says uh he said it in a song before too that he's pimping his pain you know what i mean so he's using the pain the suffering he went through turn a profit now because he's using it in his art to produce a product that people are now consuming. And so, uh, I think that this song, I think there might be some, like, I would have to go back and listen to it again yeah, because one idea. time through is not, can we pull up the lyrics? Yeah. I mean, yeah. See if we can pull up the lyrics. Maybe they're Ren always puts his in the, uh, uh actually, no, what let, call me, it? let me leave. Oh, that. did you leave the, yeah. So I can pull up the lyrics. Oh. Uh, let me find oh. lyrics real quick. Um, hang on. Well, I mean, the lyrics were on the song, but, uh... Yeah, they were, but just for shits and giggles. <laughs> yeah, I don't... Uh, yeah, I actually... I was gonna say we could just play it again, but then I was like, eh, I don't want to risk being, <laughs> being shut or, down again. Please uh, don't put me through twice. that. <laughs> <laughs> don't do that to me! I'll need it. Uh, you know what? Go right ahead. I need to take a break. <laughs> Go on without me. Okay. Oh, I make that sound like it's way more horrible than it actually was. It was not by any means horrible. It's just nothing that I would like. Like I would yeah. not listen to that. Like it's not going to be it, on the. Uh... I got it. 
Okay. Why? Why? Uh. Y'all hit the the by doing the uh, the one where the what you call it the I got it one yeah oh. you want, might want to get out of joint activity okay. so there ain't so much popped up over there oh okay I was like I don't know if I should leave the other one or not no I didn't leave it either I don't think hold on yeah. I'm trying to find it okay. come on mouse work with me work with me okay, okay so fuck. Okay, whoever's mouth, no, stop moving your mouth for I'm just a second. I'm trying to hang on. Okay, go ahead. Okay, well, I, I couldn't find if it was my mouse or your mouse. I'm like, what? Stop it. It's <laughs> funny. I can't find okay. it. Okay. Okay. Let me. All right, so uh, real quick, let me do something. Pull up this real fast so I can see chat while I'm doing it. Pop out chat. Right. Yeah, Mark, I think that's uh, part of my problem, too. Like, I, I didn't think it was necessarily terrible, but it, I, I would not, I wouldn't yeah. really listen again, to be honest. Well, it's like, okay. I I feel, I don't know, I feel like something was off in the, in the production there somewhere. Like, Prof's, like, the way he sounded versus Ren, Ren sounded almost, like, more layered in places and stuff, and it just sounded like there was much more production on Ren's verse than there was on Prof's, so I don't know if they just, like, spliced the two together or something, but, like, I feel like there should have been more to keep it balanced, but, uh, so, he starts off, well, the, I, this is the, the chorus, I'm just grinding like I'm told, I'm just trying to sell my soul, so basically, like, you know, trying to give it everything you have basically to make it, which is kind of what you have to do in the industry almost. Uh, it goes on and it goes on and on. It goes, it goes on and on. It goes. It, then it, it fucking goes, man. Uh, we've been fighting, running for some time now. Should we kill somebody? It's time to find out. That is a slightly unclear bar to me, if I'm being honest. Like, somebody as in like I, I don't know if they mean like with their music on a track type situation but uh yeah i've been a well-behaved artist yeah he you know he doesn't get super like controversial or whatever i've been selling my soul i've been prostituting my losses that's interesting like selling my soul but selling his soul probably like i don't think he means that in the way that people would take it as in like selling your soul to make a buck but selling his soul as in bearing his soul and using that in his music and selling it and making a profit what yeah I, I agree with that yeah i've uh, been rocking that role i've been cranking that soldier boy I love that dance. <laughs> uh, boy, I'm hitting that road. It's been hard to find happy. Yeah, it's, you know, it's, it kind of reminds me of like Tom's balloons or some, even some of the stuff Ren does, you know, it's like, uh, <clears throat> it's hard to find happy sometimes when you're like <laughs> at a higher level. And sometimes like the money doesn't always make you happy. It just, and sometimes it, even the, the more isolation from being more well known, like, I don't know. I feel like it can fuck with you, but I don't know. just because had... you're like making money or something right. but doesn't I, mean you're happy. I've you never made I mean? money. I'll be the test of that theory. Come on, hand me your money and we'll Shit, test right? that theory. <laughs> uh, I'm clinging. I'm hitting that note and all out of dreams. You can't say I didn't try. So I don't know if he's feeling like it's me. It says like he's, you know, he's been trying to make it, but like maybe he feels like he's hit a wall or he's not where he thinks he should be yet. You know? Oh God, yes. What? Uh, em and Ren Houdini. Whenever, oh, yeah, yeah, for joint, sure. When Joint Dell did that uh, collab, yeah, like, whew, that was awesome. That was do. That was cool. Uh, pain's guaranteed. Do you want to hurt by my side? <laughs> Got an outgoing tide. People picking their sides. When I think about my life, I want to be alive when I die. So he's, he wants to be a legend. Like, he wants to leave Mark. Uh, you know, he's... Yes, Mark, I agree. I agree. Pretty sure somebody got to die for it. Just bought myself a politician. Oh, I'm going to sneak see. through the motherfucking side door. Let's get online. Get online. Let's hear somebody. Don't get online. 
uh, my lord, thanks for the purpose. Over tell me better collabs than this. And... Uh, yeah, I agree, Mark. Um, go to Ren's verse. Uh, murder, murder. I got murder on my mind. Drag a body in the woods, dissect it, then dig a pit, then bury it. It's tricky blood. Yeah, like Sigali <laughs> said, it, it kind of gives me murder part two vibes. Yeah. Tricky blood, pull up with the prof, and then we profit. I like that. Pull yeah. up with the prof, and then we profit. Like, so, you know, pull up with him, do a collab, and they're making money off the hey, song. So does they anyone know if, like, Ren wrote his own verse? Did Ren write his own verse? Oh, yeah. Yeah, for sure. Ren, yeah, Ren, absolutely. For sure. For sure. Okay, yeah. yeah. For sure. Yeah, he wouldn't have, yeah, no, probably I'll written. tell you what, I already, just looking at the lyrics pulled up, I the difference lyrically between the two of them is to me vastly different. Yes. So which is Ren which is definitely what makes wrote his own. Yeah. Oh yeah, for real. Yeah. <sighs> uh and he he also I there's similar phrasing and words that I notice that he uses when you know when he's rapping and stuff. It's definitely Ren's writing for sure. I mean uh, I was expecting it to be. I was just wanting to make sure. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh I heard run this game we pimp in pain and bleed for fame but it's all good five syllables i i bled for music four syllables it fed me through three syllables it's it that's oh that's fucking dope, dope. like yeah he literally yeah. says five syllables and then has five syllables of words four syllables four syllables of words three syllables three syllables of words two syllables crazy crazy one syllable go that's fucking dope like uh i just i mean it's it's maybe uh, yeah it, it i bled didn't... for music well it, it's like to read it without that, I bled for music. It fed me through. It saved me crazy. Go. Yeah. See, uh, Sigali said that Prof actually reacted to this. Maybe he can help clarify some things for us or, you know. Oh, yeah. It would be interesting to to see how, like, close we are on some stuff. <laughs> uh, but that's, like, if you read it without the syllable stuff, I bled for music. It fed me through. It saved me crazy. Like, that's crazy. Yeah. Uh, I that's, think that's that's fucking brilliant right there. Like that type of writing, that's what sets and artists see, apart, and that's Amy, why Ren. Is, yeah, see, Amy, yeah. that's what we're talking about with Ren. This is what he does, like this kind of thing. Which, yeah, you know, Tom has his thing where he does things, and we're like, that's so Tom. You know, this is so Ren, right? <laughs> Well, and it's like that's what makes Tom and Ren like on that upper echelon level of of lyricists is because the way they write, like the fact that. Ren thought to write, you know, five syllables and then say something, four syllables, but then, like, over on this side actually, like, says something. I don't know. It's just, that's just fucking dope to me. And, like, just the way he says certain things, it reminds me, like, yeah, that's why I it, like him and well, Tom see, so that much. syllable thing, lyricism. I don't know. I guess it kind of brings me back to Animal Flow just a little bit as well, like, how he does the... Oh, I love that song. I know, but, like, just oh, yeah. read, read, just reading this. I know it. it's not, yeah. but what I'm saying is, like, it. there's, I guess this is the way he, he, he words things. Animal Flow is mm -hmm. dope as yeah. fuck, man. <laughs> I love that song. Oh, Animal Flow is so good. Monetize life to get Instagram famous. Ain't that the truth? Following, so he like used his life to, you know, monetize his life by Instagram famous, following blindly the mindless and the brainless. And that's, you know, I almost wonder if he's talking about, uh, if. Oh, like, Amy, I love you. He's talking about him or love his. You. Love you, Amy. Oh, love you, Amy. Uh, following blindly, er, uh, following blindly, the mindless and the brainless. The game is contagious, a pain in the anus. Like, so following blindly and the mindless and the brainless. I like. I almost wonder if he's talking about like certain fans. That's what it kind of makes me think of. Weirdly, um, you know, sometimes people follow somebody blindly and like, uh, you know, eh, like. There was a, I saw somebody post on, in the Ren group that like they were they saw a bunch of like Ren's fans like going after people who like maybe didn't agree with something in a Ren song or something like that and how they would go at them. Reminds me of us with Tom uh, no, and just... right, yeah. Well, it's like basically with Hangover Game with Tom, you know, like <laughs> but like they won't just let like a lot of us will just be like whatever. I don't no, agree, but that's fine. You can have your opinion and move right. on. But like people will actually hating. go out and tag people for it. So yeah. it's like 
those fans who like follow blindly, like they can't ever, um, they will never disagree with that person and they'll defend them. Even if like, just let the other person have their opinion. It's just their opinion. Just move on. It's fine. Right. Right. Um, but so that's, it kind of gives me like that, that type of vibe there, but the game is contagious, a pain in the anus. So like, it's a pain in the ass, but it's also like, you know, making music for them, being able to make a living like this without the industry, I would imagine that would be contagious because he knows he can produce the hits and he has been and he can keep doing it and he don't need the label and all the money goes back to him. I still think like, and Brent deserves to be m more well known than he is, to be honest. Oh, yeah, for sure. Like, it, I really I, he and I think he will. I think he will eventually. Um, OK, I'm on the cheat code on pull up with the prof. I don't know if those are the right lyrics, but trying to make, or wait, living in my Western bubble, trying to make raps in the rubble. Yeah. Living in the Western bubbles. Cause he's living in Canada, trying to make raps in the rubble. So trying to make raps in the, like what's left over after being like sick and finally getting better. Get him on the cheat code oh, cool. Pull up with prof with the tint still on do a drive by on a politician bitch die die. Yeah. Hey, miss mom. <laughs> Why do I feel like that's some shit Tom would say? Archie. Hey, hey Archie. Hey, Archie. Hey, Archie. Uh, he said, do a drive-by on a uh, no. politician, on. bitch, die, die. I don't know I'm why when he mom. said, do, he, he said the, when he said do the drive-by, I don't know why that brought me up. It reminded me of, I'll do I a drive-by. I'll wave. I'll wave. That's so funny. Uh, yeah, so, like, I mean, I think... I think the message behind the song like i think what they're trying to portray is good i think the um execution could have been improved upon that's how uh, i say it no because i love lyrics, how you're so nice but the lyrics are there like the lyrics <laughs> are right. great i agree yeah well it's yeah mm -hmm. it, it wasn't what i was expecting but i didn't hate it like i said you know i didn't hate it people is I exactly just, what he's talking about yay it's something Ren talks about. I'm so glad that I was not alone in that because I felt bad saying it was like about fans, but like like certain types of fans, right? Like not like not like the cool fans. Yeah, you know the weird ones. We're the cool fans. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I would like to think so. Uh, Actually, Ren uh, Ren, Ren killed Ren it. Ren kind of lit it up. <laughs> I mean, Prof did well too, though. I mean, he's a good rapper. Uh. He definitely is a good rapper. Hey Wait, Archie, don't just, go back and watch the, I what to, I said. <laughs> yeah, no, I need to. I need to hear. Uh, I just. I yes, need to he hear. Is. I need to. I just need to hear it more. And it's true. I guess his style is like abstract artwork. A hundred percent agree. As a producer and engineer, I'm amazed I agree. One hundred percent, Mark. I a hundred percent agree, and that's you know. It you know people like him and Tom. And all these other independent artists that are out here doing it for themselves, they're and they're they're meeting people and and getting with people who can do all this stuff together and they can work together and they have completely cut out the industry and I think that's the greatest thing ever. Like it's such sweet revenge. <laughs>